My name is Jim Mamer, and I'm the Assistant Mathematics Director uh, here at Hamilton City Schools. I've been doing a lot of work with Sherry Morris, and we do a lot of uh, collaboration together to try to think about things that are best for our kids. One of the things that has come up this year is a book a good friend of mine wrote. It's called Which One Does Not Belong, and it was written by Christopher Danielson. It's a short book that kids can use in kindergarten all the way up through calculus. With the coming of the Common Core curriculum, 85% of what's in Common Core is stuff that we've been, we've been supposedly doing for the last 20, 30, 40 years of teaching. Part of the Common Common Core was this thing called the Mathematical Practices. And within Mathematical Practices, one of the things we're supposed to be encouraging is cooperation, collaborative talk amongst our students. We want to create a climate where kids will talk with kids and where teachers facilitate this. Let's look at these shapes. Adam, what do you think this morning? Um, the, um, that one doesn't belong. All right, three, and why does it not belong? Six it had six vertices? That one because it got five vertices? Because um, two lines are intersect to two. So this one because there's two lines that intersect? No. This one and this one, they go like, oops, this one goes like this. You're right, they do. Put one thumb up if you have one shape that doesn't belong. Two up if you have two shapes that don't belong. All of the shapes in there are squares except for the rectangle. But which one doesn't belong? All of them. You gotta pick one. So when you walk into these two classrooms and see these two groups of kids talking for five to 10 minutes about which shape doesn't belong, if a teacher is doing this well, which our teachers do do well, then you will see kids jumping into these conversations. And when you look at four shapes and you try to figure out which one doesn't belong, the beauty is any of the four could not belong if you can justify it. We wanna change the mindset of kids, parents, our community about what it means to do mathematics.